Welcome to an exciting new series. We're playing Pokemon Snap. Let's go. So, as I mentioned at the end of the unintentional 12 hour stream on Friday, um, I have seen very little of this game. I did a quick little test just to make sure all the streaming setup was uh, properly in place. But other than that, I've hardly at all uh, looked at this game in any way. So, unfortunately, there's no love for us redheads, which means I'll have to go with the closest thing. Looks like we got two extra letters to play with. Look at that. So fancy. Which means I still can't do the whole thing, but we can get as close as possible. Flame and Pulsar, let's go. I haven't held the Switch controller in a long time. I'm still getting used to where buttons are. The only controller I've ever played with for a month or two is, has been the uh, GameCube controller rather than playing the Fire Raid. New Pokemon Snap. Look at that. Meow. Pika. Hello. I can't tell if they're... I don't think they're actually voicing anything, but... Hi there, glad you made it. My name is Mirror. I'm researching Pokemon in their natural environment here on Florio Island. Yeah, and that's not all. The professor is going to study every single island here in the Lentil region. No one's ever done an ecological survey like this before. It's going to be amazing. No one, aren't you forgetting a certain explorer? Oops, good point. You've read the stories of Captain Vince, haven't you? No, I haven't. <laughs> but even counting him, Professor, your survey is going to be the first of its kind in a hundred years. That's awesome. Well, thanks. This is Rita. Her parents are good friends of mine. She's here on vacation while her school's on break. Hello. I'm not just here to goof off, Professor. I'm your research assistant. <laughs> yes, that's right. And I appreciate the help. Now, before we go over what you'll be doing in this program, why don't we step into the lab to get settled? Right, you are, Professor. I'll lead the way. Let's go. All right, allow me to explain. The Lentil region is absolutely teeming with Pokemon. Photographing those Pokemon helps us learn more about them and their ecosystems. There we go. Turn the, the game volume up a little bit. You can actually hear the music. And that's exactly what you're here to do. At night, you might even get to see glowing Pokemon. They're pretty. They're, yeah, they're really pretty. Now, without further ado, let's... Here's your research camera. Cool. I've got the same one. You can use them to communicate with each other and the rest of the team, too. That's right. It's more than just a camera. It lets you keep in touch and analyze data on the fly. Yep. 
it'll also serve as a sort of ID badge for for you here. So take good care of it. Will do. Wow, fancy. Oh, fancy shutter. Cool. What do you think? Awesome, right? The professor invented it. Professor. Explain how to use the professor. Anyway. Sure thing, Rita. Assist away. I'll go take care of some other preparations. Yeah. All right, come on, let's go outside. Did we just come in here? Well, whatever. Tutorials are based on default button layouts. Got it. Let's, let's see. Aha! Uh -huh. Perfect timing. Try getting a shot of them. The oh, he's already funny. <laughs> Bop. Oh, okay. All right. Got it. Can do. Okie dokie. Move. Can I take another picture or no? No. Up, down, all the way around. We motion controls. I'm not gonna use motion controls. That sounds too difficult. It's Pikachu. Got. It. Pikachu. Got it. Got it. Okay. Click. Okay. Zooming in. Wow. Fancy. ZL button. Okay. Okie dokie. Zoom. Hello, Pikachu. Pikachu. Can do. Cool. I'm so awesome. Okie dokie. Back inside. Lot up in and out. <laughs> How is that? I hope you're getting the hang of your research camera. Anyway. Now then, I'll evaluate the photos you took. First of all. Would you mind choosing one shot of each Pokemon you photographed? I'll rate them using my special scoring system. Pick whichever shots you think are best. Beep beep beep. Guys, I like the Pikachu folder. Back at you. Choose a photo with left and right arrow pointers or by moving the pointer. Press A when you decide which one to show. Okie dokie. That one. Now, try selecting the pavilion. The only picture we took. Show, Professor. Let's go. Starting with photo number one. Let's pick a chow. Well. First thing I do is rate each photo from one to four stars. I came up with this system to help us understand and categorize how Pokemon behave. Photos of Pokemon in any in an ordinary state get fewer stars. More unusual behavior means more stars. Understandable. Simple enough, right? Yep. Be clear the number of stars the photo receives doesn't affect its score. Every category is important. Okay. By the way, the camera keeps logs of what is happening uh, when you took each photo. That's yeah, Pikachu! <laughs> that data helps me categorize your photos. Okay. Let's move on to the scoring. First, I'll evaluate the subject's pose. Snapping your photo at just the right moment is key to getting a high pose score. On to the other factors. Size is straightforward. The larger your subject, 
Pokemon appears in the photo, the better. Okay. And there's the direction the Pokemon is facing. Try to get it facing you in the, your photos. Makes sense. Placement. Try to get it in the center of the frame for a nice balanced photo. And finally, you'll get bonus points if other Pokemon are in the photo with your subject Pokemon. Cool. I know that was a lot of info all at once. Let me boil it down. Remember this and you'll be fine. Get the Pokemon nice and big in the center of the frame, then snap the shutter. With all that in mind, here's your evaluation. Alright, not bad. Woo! And then the only picture it let us take of the pavilion is not a great picture. I feel like they probably did that on a purpose, on a purpose though. Yeah. Remember, getting the whole Pokemon in the frame, looking nice and big, it's getting a good size score. Yep. I would have, but I didn't have ability to do that at the time. How was it? What did you think? Once you get your photos evaluated, you can use them to fill out your very own Pokemon photo decks. Cool. That'll be a great milestone to work toward. That does it. I think it's time you set off on your adventure. We're going on an adventure. That should about do it. I just tried to left trigger for A button. I'm so used to GameCube controller. See this pod? It'll carry you on your photo photography ex expeditions. I almost said photography. It's called the Neo One. It's the best. It can teleport to far off places in no time flat. Here's the thing. I finally put the finishing touches on it not long ago, with little help from someone I know. You see, it makes use of energy hotspots scattered throughout the lentil region. Come on, Professor, the details can wait. Fair enough. Let's get you moving. Climb on in and touch your camera to the console. Okie dokie. Boop. I like her hairstyle. I don't want it. <laughs> like the the back braid. Enjoy your first photo expedition. Mm. The one automatically sets a route so you can focus on controlling your camera. Okie dokie. I didn't get to read all that, but okay. <laughs> Buffon. There we go. So the main difference between this and uh, the original Pokemon Snap game is that now literally everything looks like a Pokemon. <laughs> it's uh, gotta really look. Aw, be doofy shy. Hmm? It's a Wurple. Got it. It also doesn't help that I'm not super familiar with some of the newer Pokemon. It's not a Wurple. Like, my, my knowledge only goes through, like, some parts of Gen 7, and also some parts of Gen 8. I, was like, I don't know what the Crystal Bloom is, but I'm taking a picture of it. <laughs> Here's the Halo. Well, that's enough. <laughs> Can I get these two together? Nope. Well, I can get the one at least. Need a magic carp over there. I'm gonna see if I can get a closer picture. 
I see Pichu. A little in the grass, but uh, at least a picture. Something's flying overhead. No? Okay. I was I was late. Double B doof. And uh do 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 I think I already got a do do picture, but whatever. Doesn't hurt to get extras. Ah, there's a good magic carp. Splashy splashy. That wasn't the great picture. I think there was something in that tree though. It wasn't fast enough. Ah, there's just so many everything everywhere. <laughs> Ooh, I like that tail up picture. If I can get closer. That tail is sitting on top of this sign. So cute. Beautiful. Calm fate. Can I get you to look at me? Maybe. <laughs> I don't know if they counted. Oh, that looks like a Florgis. Not a bad picture. More pavilions. Got it. Let's see if I can get a better pavilion picture. Oh, nope. Ran out of time. Oh well. Hope you had a good time in Florio Nature Park. I sure did. Just like before, it's time to show you me some photos you took. Go ahead and choose one photo per Pokemon. Okie dokie. Mm, yeah, we can. Might as well. Got a couple Dodrio. That one's bigger. There's a Bidoof butt in the way. <laughs> Which actually might give it a better score because it has more than just the Dodrio in it. Boofalant. Hmm. Hard to say. Oh, I got, I got a one star and a two star. Can I? I can't show both of them. Darn. Lots well, of Two one stars. That one's probably better. You hey, wearing blue? Boop pop. Boop pop. That one's closer. I only got the one floor just picture. Got a couple of Taylo. That one has more Taylo, but that one is closer, and I also like that one better. We'll go with that one. Swana. Yeah, we're going with that one. <laughs> Ichu! I only took the one. Magikarp, only got the one. Tomfei, I got two here. Eh, I think that one's probably better. Oh, I can't select this one. I don't know what it is. I took a picture of it. It, it showed as a crystal bloom. Must be something for later. Let's go! All right. Let's have a look. Our new pavilion. Let's have a look and see what it shows. Pose is the same. Better size. Direction not quite as good, but placement is better. And apparently there was another Pokemon in there. I don't know why, but... Cool. Tis better. The Drio. That's a new Pokemon. What do we got? Good pose. Good size. Cool, cool. Nice and big. Well done. Nicely done. Oofalon. Two star. Looks like it's fast asleep. Yup. Okay, whole Pokemon frame looking nice and big. It's key to a good size. Yeah. 
Whatever. No big deal. Bidoof. Not bad. More Pokemon you get in a photo. More insight it gives us to, into the area's ecosystem. Adorable. Look at those. Seems like it's on its way somewhere. It's in it always. Playing close-ups of the faces. I will do my best. Lurgis. Fairly common behavior. Yeah. Chilling around with flowers. Nice man, it's good. Cool. Look at that yellow. Swana. Pichu in the grass. I don't expect one, this one to do very well. Mm, not terrible. Yeah. Closer it is looking directly at the camera, the better. Yeah. Need to keep. Cool, cool. No, was I not centered? <laughs> I guess I was a little above the center. Whatever. Pompey! It's in flight. Be careful how you position Pokemon's face and body. Yeah. It was hard to get the face on the Pompey. So what did you think? tell you about research levels. The research level on the course tells you how much progress you've made there. Once that level goes up, you may see Pokemon behave in ways you haven't seen before. Hmm. Key to raising your research level is to observe all types of Pokemon's behaviors. This means getting photographs of them in every category from one to four stars. Okay. So in short, fill up that photo deck, keep that in mind, and you'll be on the right track. Get out there and snap lots of photos, and cherish the encounters with Pokemon you have along the way. I'd never have guessed it was your first trip out there. Keep up the good work. Okie dokie. Photo program newbie. Look this way. Cool. Smack dab in the middle. Nailed it. Uh, save photos to album. After your research trips, you can choose photos to save to your album, which is your space in the lab. Also choose Resnap to make some changes to photos before you save them. Okie dokie. Uh, at the very least, I do want to save that Halo. I do like that Halo. Nice and calm. Swana in flight. No twinkly behavior? Question mark. It's magic harp. It's hard to say. Where is it going? Hurry, hurry. Pretty common behavior. Yeah. Yeah, I'll I'll grab the sleeping dodo. Yeah, or dodrio. Sure. All right. Those are the ones I want to save. Cool. 
We return to camp. A young girl who loves Pokemon and helps Professor Mirror as his research is done. Her curly ponytails are her signature look. Yup. That covered just about everything. Can we go on a nighttime photo shoot later? Not yet, but soon, after a little more practice. By the way, don't forget you can come back to the lab and take a look at your photo decks anytime. Cool. I'll explain really more about that when you stop at the lab. Okie dokie. Well, don't let me keep you any longer. Have a good time and snap some photos. Can do. Look at settings. Because one thing I do want to look at is turning the camera speed up just a smidge. Wait. I don't know if it's camera speed or pointer speed. Turn them both up. Oops. <laughs> I can't control. Head <laughs> out to another organization already. Uh, yeah, I guess. Uh, let me tell you one more thing you can do with your research camera. What is that? You can run a scan. It'll give you details about your surroundings. Tells you about nearby Pokemon and points out anything unusual. What kind of says unusual? You've never given me a solid answer. Basically anything that makes the system go, check this out. Yeah. Well, I guess that's all the detail we're going to get. Yep. Okay. You'll get the hang of it once you try it. Rita, would you mind demonstrating? Yeah. Leave it to me, Professor. Alright, get that camera ready. Camera ready. boop doop boop Yep. Based on default button layouts. Got it. Running a scan. Oh, she, she's talking. Wait, press X. Okay. Try it out. Press X. Wom. Pikachu. Question mark. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mwong. The Neo one, this vehicle is essential for your Pokemon research. Got it. When you see that, try running a scan. Careful with the rest. Okay, doggy. I almost forgot. There's one more cool thing you should know about scanning. What's that? Pokemon will react to the sound and electrical signal from the scan. If it gets their attention, it's your chance to snap a photo. The professor called it an out of bed and CT feature. Anyway, that ought to cover everything. Okay, doggy. Hey, Professor, explanation is all done. Thank you. Thanks, Rita. Don't hesitate to run a scan. It'll tell you a lot about your surroundings. Okie dokie. Okay. I want to turn that down to like four. Camera speed is probably fine. Left to controls, right to controls. Do, 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 do. Eh, we'll hold hold the zoom. Yeah, right, I think we're good here. Let's go. Try taking lots of photos of Pokemon at the nature park during the day. Okie dokie. Mm -hmm. Nature park is open to the public, so most of the Pokemon there are used to being around people. Okie dokie. 
Let's go. Pick up the 72 photos for a research expedition. Do your best. That's a better pavilion picture. I got them both. <laughs> That's a pretty sure I got them both. Yeah, the bouffalant. Need a picture of the common bouffalant behavior for the one star. Let's see a bouffalant. That was something. Is that an Amolga? Oh, it is an Amolga. Well. Charred fruits. Did a Pokemon do this? Mm, perhaps. bloom that grows on Florio Island. Okay. All you're gonna give me? Okay. Too fast. What that? The hoodoo. Currently asleep, but. There's an unusual way of sleeping, always on one foot. <laughs> Almost Let's go. I didn't get a picture of the Emolga, I don't think. It was too fast for me. Any new pavilion pictures? That might be a little better. Grookey! That's good, Grookey. Oofalot. I do go for that one. Nope, it was too fast for us. That looks like uh, that's a two star. So yeah, we'll go ahead and get it in there. Hoot hoot. 
and comfy. Got a two star. Nice. Let's go. Yeah. The Dodrio picture wasn't anything <laughs> of interest. It's a billion. It's mesmerizing. Nice work. In flight. Much better size. Yeah. We'll keep that one. That's much better. A new discovery. It's Grookey. Is it new? I thought I had a Grookey picture last time. It looks curious. Probably about me. <laughs> it's the one star photo. Oh, that's new. Really going behavior. Perfect timing. You did wonderfully. On its way somewhere. New record, woo! Try pairing with striking back roots. A two star photo. Natural state. Yep. Try getting close up to the faces. Do we have to sleep? Yup. I would if it were awake. Next we got a comfy. Two star photo. Looks like something caught its attention. Probably me running the scan. So it's dead center, so it feels balanced. Yep. Cool. Woo! Level up. Nice. Another step forward for our research. I bet Pokemon in the area are getting comfortable with you. Cool. Together with friends. By the way, thanks to the progress you've made in your research, I've got something to report. I'll fill you in once your photos are squared away. I think you'll be pleased to hear this. I do like the rookie picture. And I think that was the only one I really cared to save. Yeah. Cool. No, wait. Yeah. Okay. Return to camp. Your photography seems to be going well. Anyway. I think you're about ready for a nighttime visit to Florio Nature Park. Yes, please. Here's the thing. Mm. Hopefully, you'll get to see one of Lentil's greatest wonders, a glow called the Illumina Phenomenon. Of... You're the one who discovered it, and how that glow happens, right, Professor? Mm -hmm. Yes, I am, but explaining the process scientifically was just one step toward my ultimate goal. Finding the special Pokemon spoken of in the Legends of the Lentil. You mean the Illumina Pokemon? I thought they were made up. No. no, they're very much real. You've seen the photos from Captain Vince's travel log, haven't you? 
you can barely tell what's in those photos. And they're ancient anyway, literally a hundred years old. Well, we can discuss that later. For now, enjoy your nighttime outing. Woo. Pokemon's nap. After hours. Let's go. At night, you might be able to see the Illumina phenomenon at Nature Park. Observe your surroundings carefully. Will do. Do, 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 do. Night. Ooh, spooky. Ooh, score button. Well, there's a score bunny for one thing. Boofalant, happily sleeping. Stupid score bunny. I imagine the hoot hoot will be awake this time. Gotcha. Oh, Tangrowth. Hello. Mercos. Coming up from an unnatural bump. Or terrace. Nope, they're just sleeping. Okay. Are they going to be in the way? It's entirely possible. Swana. Ducklets. Nope, not in the way. Okay. There's a Pidgeot. All kinds of new stuff to see. There's the Hoot Hoot. Marco. Grookey. Oh, there he is. Look at that little grookey. And the Pichu. That's adorable. That's a good hoot hoot picture. There's so much to see. That wasn't a very good picture. It wasn't centered. Oh well. And there's another good hoot hoot picture. What are looking our way just now? Ooh, combi. Buzz buzz. What? That Torterra is awake. Bloom. Mm, giving off a blue glow. Interesting. What? I want the score bunny. I don't know if that counted as a score bunny or a Torterra. I also didn't hear what Rita was trying to say. 
I was too busy trying to get that picture. Let's ask him about it when we get back. Okay. Got a lot to discuss, but first, let's get your photos evaluated. Okay. I like this plane. Now, lots of options. Score bunny. Okay, so I didn't get it sleeping. But I did get that one, at least. Which I think is probably going to be the best picture. It's a two-star, too. Ufalant. Nothing new. Snoring away. Tangrowth. Big ol' face. Is that really the best Murkrow I got? Darn. Yeah, that one's not centered, but that one's not facing the camera. I'm gonna go with that one. Combi. Caterpie. Got a couple. Well, I got some four stars in there. Look at that. Oh, they're all four stars. <laughs> well then. What is the best one I can do here? Probably that one. Nice and centered. Grookey. Just the one. Hoot hoot. That's a good picture. Pidgeot. Uh, uh, got a one star and a two star. Well, we'll get the one star out of the way first again, I guess. Or the two star, rather. Duck lid. I got a few of those. I like that one better. Swana. One's a little bit better, I think. Or Terra, we got a few of those. I'm trying to get that score bunny. That is a score bunny picture, not a Torterra picture. Darn you. Fine. That's a good Torterra picture though. Uh Pichu. A nice sleepy picture, of Pichu. Look at that, it's adorable. And random picture <laughs> that I took for no reason. Yeah. Let's go. Let's do this. Bye bye. Seems like something caught its attention. Dangrowth. I know it's not centered, but it, uh, I think it's a better picture. It's in flight. Yep. Try getting close up to the faces. Yep. 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 All things we already know. That's actually not terrible. It could be closer though. Combi. Yeah. Size is not great. Interesting backgrounds. Canopy. Yeah, this you don't see every day. Cool. Oh, Tara. Fairly common behavior. Yep. Swana, two star. Good pose. Better size. Yeah, better all around. Duck lip. Not bad. Pity up. Nice 
Mercurius. Probably because I scanned it. Nice and big. Nope. A new Hoot Hoot picture. Oh yeah, much better. Ooh, look at that size though. Two thousand. And a P2 right next to it. <laughs> Glorious. Ooh, new record. Yes, of course I'm keeping that one. It's adorable. Looks like you got the hang of that time research. Keep up the good work. Will do. As big as possible. We got a score of 2,000 points or more. Cool. Night. By the way, yes. Thanks to the progress you've made in your research, I've got something to report. What's that? I'll fill you in once your photos are squared away. I think you'll be pleased to hear this. Okay. Save photos. I want to get... I want to get the Grookey. And the Pikachu, or the Pichu, rather. And that who <laughs> And this Gore Bunny, not Torterra. Actually. The other one's better. There's a Score Bunny, not a Torterra. <laughs> Just brightness, the angle, and other settings to retype the photo. Meh. Okay. Now then. Talk to me, Professor. What do you got? Whoa. What that? Yes. Take a look at this. Here's the thing. Got near that field of flowers. Picked up an incredibly strong energy reading. Also. Its source seemed to be moving too, if only slightly. Suggest that what we've got here is an Illumina Pokemon? I can't be sure yet, but I suspect so. I wonder why you showed up. Did you do anything special? No, no Rita saying that, but whatever. I also doubt that it appeared when it did by chance. So I think you should be on the one to investigate the area where that reading is coming from. What? Oh, I wanna go see too! You can watch through the monitor with me, Rita. Please head out as soon as you're ready. Can you do? Let's go. Let's go to the luminous spot, the nature park. The luminous spot. Nope. Ooh, shiny. Ooh. 
a meganium. A rather large meganium. Why is it so big? Oh. Okay. There's a tree in the way. There we go. Okay. I think I have like twelve pictures of the Meganium. <laughs> Let's get photos evaluated. Let's go. Meganium. That one. Does that one not count? Or is he only want special pictures? I think. Okay. Yeah. Let's go down. Let's have a look. Nice pose. You got a score of a thousand or more in pose. Cool. Gentle wonder. Registered aluminum Pokemon Man Meganium. By the way, now that we've got that aluminum Pokemon photo, or info, I've got something to report. Okay. Save photos to album. I like that picture. That's a good picture.
Alright, I think that's all. We do the camp. That I am. That was amazing, right? Wasn't it gorgeous? Wasn't it huge? And it was... And wasn't it? Say something. Easy there, Rita. Take a deep breath. Look who's talking. You were practically dancing, Professor. <laughs> Moving on. There's no doubt about it. That Meganium wasn't a uh, Pokemon. Just like in the Legends. Remind me what the legends say about Illumina Pokemon again, Professor? Didn't they supposedly save Lentil from a huge disaster a long time ago or something? Mm -hmm. So the story goes, yes. Also. The Illumina Pokemon were also said to have distinctive patterns and glow with unusual light. Huh? It sounds like our new friend. Right. Yes, to the letter. I'm convinced the events in those legends really did happen. And discovering the true history of this region could be the key that opens up all our research. Oh. Hang on, wasn't it there one more important thing you were gonna show you were gonna mention, Professor? That's right. It's all it's pretty late. Let's pick up on the conversation from here tomorrow. Good morning! Did you manage to get some sleep? Nope. Now, as Rita already told you, I've been preparing to launch an ecological survey spanning the entire Lentil region. And no sooner had you arrived than we suddenly found an Illumina Pokemon. You think there's a connection, Professor? I can't be sure yet. But fascinating things are bound to happen if you come with us. Really? Really? No. <laughs> Well, you know, maybe. For a scientist, you sure can be vague sometimes, Professor. But... Still, I think it's a good idea. <laughs> It'll be way more fun with you along. Right. Well, there you have it. Ready to officially join our research team? Sure. Let's do it. Well... Hmm. Yeah. Wow. Fancy. Look at me, I'm adorable. Yep. Like you were born to wear it. All right. Well, what are you waiting for? Adventure awaits. Adventure is out there. Ka -ka 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 <laughs> uh, not to not to rain on your parade, Rita. But I need to get a couple more things ready first. Aw, oh, come on! Just a little bit longer, alright? I promise it'll be worth the wait. I'll explain next time you're headed out to do some research. So, in like two seconds? No. I gotta open presents first. Theme badge. Woo! Theme badge. Profile icon. Cool. Uh, yeah. Let's go. All right. Now that you're a full-fledged team member, I have something for you that'll come in handy. And an apple. As for the explanation, would you do the honors, Rita? Yeah. Yes, sir. Huh? But is it just me, or have you been getting me to do? A, but is it just me, or have you been getting me to do a lot more work lately, Professor? Oh well, time to explain the greatest, like the greatest isn't I am. This is a fluff fruit. They grow here on, in the lentil region. They're sweet and tasty and they make a great snack for Pokemon. They may look just like regular apples. But they're way lighter and softer. You'll probably make a Pokemon's day if you toss it, it one of these. All right. Let's get you some practice. Okay. Practice away. Throw the base on default button layouts. Got it. You can throw a fluff fruit by pressing the B button. 
Give me a button. Blood fruit. Pikachu. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. Pretty easy, right? I think that should be all you need to know. So I guess we just wait until the professor gives us the green light to move on. Oh, I've got an idea. You should try testing out Fluffer and taking some, some more Pokemon. Eh, some more photos in the meantime. Professor says there are all kinds of ways to use it. Finished explaining? I see. Thanks, Rita. I've got one more thing to tell you about for now. I thought it would be handy to have a quick way to share what we see and learn in the field. Are you too familiar with Lentalk? Nope. Ring the bell, I think. Yep. It's a communication tool folks here on Lentil use. Rita, let's say you notice something exciting in the field. You can send a photo and a description over Lentalk. You can use it to send things I know. Eh, I I can use this to send things I notice on the monitor too. Huh. That sounds super fun. By the way. Look for Lentalk messages in the top right of the screen, at the research camp, and elsewhere. They ought to help. Okie dokie. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go back to the day path and throw some fruits around. See what we can see with that. Nom nom. Not the Emolga. Missed that before. Marble. No. That just scared him away. <laughs> See what happens if I throw it at the magic carp?
Ingrowth loved them. <laughs> Got it. Yep, Larry's in his hair. Nothing new on the rookie front. The mall guy is new. Magic Arp. Got a big ol' splash. Wimple and Florges. Ooh, we got a three star in Florges. Cool. We bet Boof a lot. Hmm. Apparently that doesn't count. Oh. At least I not in something new. Not bad. Meet group. Nice work. What fascinating behavior. Hmm? Having a nice meal. Nom nom. Not too bad. Three star photo. Not bad. Give me that yummy experience. <laughs> Delicious. I want that picture. Such style. <laughs> Blinding light. <laughs> yeah. 
Not really anything there to change. And I don't think there's anything else I really want to save. Yeah. Let's go with the night path this time. See what throwing some food around does me. Look at me used to be score money. I don't know if I could tell on that what it was doing, but Stuff I already know about, although could potentially no. I think I need uh, whatever this game's equivalent of the pester ball is. <laughs> Pincer. I didn't see that before. <laughs> I'm, I'm trying to knock it down. No. I can't knock it down. Okay. <laughs> Wanted to see what happened. sure it registers as the correct Pokemon. Okay. 
Anything new for Brew Font? Nope. Score bunny though. Lots of one star stuff. I like the sleeping score bunny. It's adorable. And sir, I only managed to get the one. And that's it. I don't know why I took a picture there. I guess I could have done the Duckwood and Swana, but oh well. They were moving a little too fast anyways. I don't think I've got very good pictures there. Yeah, it's a good score bunny picture. It's Pinsir. Nailed it. Not bad. Level up. All right. uh, step forward for our research. I bet Pokemon in the area are getting comfortable with you. They sure seem to be. Anything I want to save? I do like the sleepy score, buddy. Yeah, the Declan and Swana pictures were not all that great. <laughs> That Todd? Jeez. It's weird seeing an older Todd. <laughs> this is Todd. He's a pro professional Pokemon profo professional Pokemon photographer. Jeez. That is hard to say. This work takes him all over the world. Are you the one who got the an Illumina Poke? No. Oh. Are you the one who got an Illumina Pokemon on camera? Way to go! It's a big deal! So? Did you bring what I asked for? You too? Hmm. I sure did! Thank you. You're a lifesaver! Now we'll finally be able to set out! Huh? huh? Is this guy a friend of yours, Professor? Mm -hmm. An old travel companion, to be precise. He's been helping me plan our big survey of Lentil, too. Huh. No kidding! Oh, is that the new pod you put together? Reminds me of the good old days. Okay. But hey, let me see those Illumina Pokemon photos. Wow, you've really got an for this. Hmm. Well, thanks. Hey, huh? hmm? Who that? Uh, okay. <laughs> Who this? So you're the new lit, the new teammate, huh? I'm Phil, Todd, number one student. Okay now. Easy there, Phil. Well, I'm tempted to take part part in this big ecological survey myself, but I have other another idea. Bleh, I can't talk. How about I send Phil with you instead? Yep. I'm fine with that if you are, Todd. Awesome. Yes, awesome. You can be you can be my stand in for now. But don't forget, you'll I'll need that badge back eventually. Oh, oh fine, but if, if I take a super cool photo, I get to keep the badge. And, uh, so yeah, what's an ecological survey? Uh, it's hard juggling all these voices. <laughs> Listen up, team. I'm going to give you a breakdown of the survey. 
Okay. This is Florida Island, our home sweet home. The circled spot right here is our camp. Also. This survey will take us past these shores. And this will be our first destination. Hey, so. Why are we starting there? Yep. I've detected a spot where the high energy readings, the Neo One, should, should be able to teleport to it. Wow. This island showed up on the travel log, right? Mm -hmm. It certainly did. Captain Vince wrote that he saw a glowing Pokemon there, too, in fact. Come on, Come on already. Let's get this survey thing started. Agreed. Fair enough. Anyway. Enjoy your first in a century adventure into the wilds of Lentil. Research. Let's go. Ooh, wow. I want to go to the Volcano Island. No, oh, I, I, I want to go to the Volcano Island. Oh, right. Fine. I, I, I want to go to the Volcano Island. Can I go to Volcano Island? That looks fun. <laughs> Fine. The Fuja Jungle. Let's go. A boom sweet. So it was in. Hey, Palm. Hey, Palm, you're too fast. You registered, but it wasn't a very good picture. Boom sweet. Pick a pick. Trying to turn around faster. What's that? Ooh. The Pokemon web. Oh, hello, Beautifly. Yeah, there's a slack in there. I didn't get a very good picture of it, though. At least get it registered. Another beautiful fly. What do we got? What? What is it? Crystal bloom that grows on Blue Silva Island. Another picky peck. Quagsire! I, no, wait. Could be a beautiful fly. But Quagsire, though. Look at, Look at that derp. It's a decent, better a palm at least. Hey, Bob. Hey, Bob. There we go. Nom, nom, nom. Yummy, yum. What else? What else is new? Searching, searching, searching. Searching behind, I guess. I suppose I should probably do that. Maybe a little. What else we got? What new for me to look at? Nope, too late. A flock of picky peck. Ooh, look at that view. What? 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 Ancient ruins, okay. Stop distracting me, I'm trying to get good pictures. Like that leopard. Or that leopard. <laughs> A couple leopards, actually. <laughs> mm. 
There's another magic carp there. Swimming instead of splashing. I meant to push the other button. Magic carp. More lipards. Beautifly. Couple of quagsires. Big sploosh. Big sploosh. Anything else that I may have missed? Looks like a lipard tail. And then a little picky pick. Is that a light bar? What is that? That is a light bar, okay. Cool cave. Nope, okay, we're done. <laughs> Lots of new discoveries. Discoveries. Being sweet. That's a good one. Hey, Pop. That's probably the best one. Picky pack. Uh, oh, that one. Oops. <laughs> that way. Beautiful. Eye. That one's probably best, actually. Mage group. No, still one stars. Okay. Smacking. It's the only picture I got of it, but at least get it registered. Quagsire. Lipard. Sleeping or walking. We'll go with the sleepy one. Being sweet. Mm, not terrible. Not great either, but not terrible. Look at that A-pop. Crunching on its snack. Not bad. Picking at a tree. Not bad. Could be closer, but that's about it. That's a good beautiful picture, though. Look at that. Beautiful. Yeah, that's not a good picture. <laughs> Is it? Okay. No, no, not a very good picture. Quagtire! Look at that little derp. He's so adorable. Alright, not bad. Light part. Not looking at the camera, but that's fine. Yeah. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Mm -hmm. yeah, research in the spot is just getting started. Let's all research team. Ooh. 
for free. By the way, if you like it, I can start uploading standout photos for you. They deserve to be seen wild, widely, not wildly. Photos I upload would be added to your collection online. On your page, they'd be marked as my favorites. Uh, okay. Let's see, what do I want to save here? I like these beautiful pictures. All of them, really. Or, meh. Most of them. <laughs> That's a good one, though. That's about it, though. Odd tips. As big as possible. Gonna be right in the center of the frame. Let's go. So deep in thought, I didn't even notice you. Sometimes, if you look carefully at the trees, ta da! Pokemon will show itself. It's always fun when that happens. Yes, but I can't look at every single tree all the time. Multiple Pokemon in a photo. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Keep forgetting about the eight bomb. Oh well. I do want to make sure I get a good uh, boon sweet picture though. Get them facing the right way. Beautiful. Beautiful. Was... Ooh, an Arbok. Whole bunch of picky pick. So the right joystick, I feel like it needs to be reversed. Otherwise, it's gonna mess me up. Beautiful eye blocking our way. Arbok! Arbok! Hey, Arbok. Come here. No. Arbok. Fine. Mm. Dang it. Hey, Bomb. Come back. Mm. Fine, whatever. He was, he was posing for me. I wasn't fast enough. Quagsire! You derp. <laughs> yeah, yeah, there's stuff around, I know. Oh, I didn't actually get that one. <laughs> I still didn't get that one. Dang it. That's a good life art picture. What now? That's one of the edge ruins. Being engulfed by enormous trees. I need, I need to be ready for the uh, slacking. Up on the left. Make sure I get a better picture of it.
That's a decent magic herb. Wait, did I miss those lacking? I guess so. Oh well. Maybe I must have missed it. Well, dang it. I got the Arbok. That's me. Sweet, sweet. A pom. Wait, did it not count the Arbok? It didn't count the Arbok? Really? The freaking Arbok. How can you not see that as an Arbok? Come on. Fine. Be that way. Life hard. Uh, I'll try that picture. Music keep beautiful. You can compare it at least. I guess I'll have to go get a better picture of Narbok that actually counts as a Narbok. Two star photo of Boon Sweet. Hey, Pom. Lipard. Not bad. Cool. Mage Keep. A little bit better. Mm, looks like the old one's better. I like the old one better anyways. I just wanted to double check. Beep -de beep. Now that I find random research. Anything I want to save? Not particularly me. All right. Retry. There we go. Arbok. There we go. That's a better picture. Let me sure I'm not missing that slacking though.
while also trying to get good pictures of everything else. Well, hello there. Quaggy. No, nothing. Nothing from the quag. It's too much of a derp. Where is the slacking at? I keep thinking that it's coming up. But also, I, I think that I might have missed it. <laughs> Getting paranoid. It's stupid lacking. I didn't mean to take a picture of that, but whatever. Take it back. Magic group. Lipards. Where is the slacking? Did I already miss it again? Going crazy about the stupid slacking. more. Maybe. Wait for it. Wait for it. Got it. All right, I have no idea where this stupid slacking is. I saw it once and I will never see it again. You'll never see the slacking though. Mm -hmm. New Apom picture, we can give it a try. New Boon Sweet picture, we'll give it a go. Arbok, we actually got it this time. New beautifly picture, nothing new out of the ordinary, you know. The okay. part, not the best picture. Magic herb, nothing new there. Baggy boy. Does that not count for something? No? Fine. Well, no, I don't. I want to show it anyways. And yeah, didn't, didn't mean to actually take that for sure. Yep, let's go. Now then. Let's see what we've got. I think the old one's probably better. Yeah, yeah, we'll give the old one. We need to get a good face picture of them though. Boon Sweet. Slightly better pose. 
better all around, actually. Alright, cool. Yep, we'll get the new one. Arbok! We actually got it this time. All around, not bad. Oh. New Quaggy. No? Yeah, Alright, fine. We'll keep the old one then. No big deal. Level 2. Ooh. Level up. Look at that, you've hit a new stage in your research. Keep an eye out for new changes, no matter how small. By the way, thanks to the progress you've made on your research, I've got something to report. Yep. Fill you in once your photos are squared away. Square photos away. You know what? He might not have liked it, but I don't want to take the dive in Quagsire. I like it. Eh, that's it. Let's go. What you got for me? Do I get the pester ball now? I want pester ball, please. Or is there a pester ball in this game? All right. I don't have anything assigned to the Y button. Looks like you're finding your feet on New Island. About time I gave you your next task. Oh, what is it? What is it? I'd like you to visit the jungle during the night and photograph a crystal bloom glowing in the dark. What's a crystal bloom? It's a type of flower that can give off light. Do yep. you remember seeing any odd flowers out there? Yeah. Oh yeah, I did. Red ones. Mm -hmm. That's probably the type we're after. If you see one lit up at night, it's what it's in what we call the luminous state. Do we need to do anything special if we find one? No. Not particularly. Just snap a photo of it. Your camera can analyze it for you. Thanks. That should be all you need to know for now. Enjoy the nighttime jungle. Spooky. Thanks. Oh, yeah. This is... Blah, blah, blah. Tough to get a good shot. The leaves are all... In. Yep. That is true. True indeed. It's pretty dark up there. You might have a hard time finding Pokemon. Maybe. New life our picture. Majestic Lipard. Moral. Mm. Don't let me throw anything at the web. That would typically attract the owner of said web. Ah, there it is. Ariados. See if I can attract it. Ariados, come back. Dang it. There's an Ari couple Ariados actually. Got it.
Let him. Couple more morals over there. Let him. Marlow. I don't know what that was. And the carp's still chilling down there. Some sleeping Marlow. That light part again. Look at that quaggy boy glowing. Look, two magic carp. That's new. Not the Yanma. Yan Mega. Keep thinking of those, those are masquerading. They're just lily pad pods. Remember what I was saying about everything looking like a Pokemon? <laughs> Marlo. Baggy boy. Got it. And also the quaggy boy. Mm -hmm. Hey, quaggy boy. Quaggy. No. No other. Is there anything in the cave? No. Oh, wait. There's a Yan Mega in there. <laughs> I already got a Yan Mega picture. Light part. Nothing new to see. I want to try that picture though. More little, I got a lot of them. <laughs> oh, that one. Ariados. Only counted one of them. Lydian. That's a good picture. Quaggy! Mm. They all count as three stars. That one's the biggest. That's the only thing I'm going by. <laughs> Mitch group. We can compare, might as well. Yan Mega. I think that one's probably better. And of course, the Crystal Bloom. What say you, Professor Mirror? I like hard. How does it compare? Not as good. 
Point of placement. Yeah, we'll keep the old one. More lol. Not bad. Look at that diamond star. Beautiful. I'm so good. First try. Are you this? Oh, side direction placement. Yep, yep, yep. Cool, cool. Lydian. Yeah, I like that picture though. What fascinating behavior. <laughs> Silver. Alright. Not bad. Could be better. Quaggy. Sleepy Quaggy. Golden Sleepy Quaggy. Wow. Good, good. That one's got two Magikarps in it now. That didn't help it much. Okay. We'll get the old one then. Yeah, Mega. Not bad. Yeah, the crystal button. Alright. Yep. What do we get? Bug. Registered seven pieces of bug types. Cool. And got the red crystal one. Yay. By the way. Now that we've got that crystal blooming foo, I've got something to report. Okay. Let me save some photos here. I do like that letting in photo. It's a good photo. The light parts. Mm, not those ones. The moral though, I do like. Yeah. Okay. Return to camp. Yep. Great job. Your photos gave us plenty of data to work with. Now, I've got something new to show you. Take a look. Oh, those are the orb thingies you've been working on, Professor. Didn't you say they could make Pokemon and Crystal Blooms glow? Exactly, I call them Illumina Orbs. Unfortunately, blue Illumina Orbs only work here on Florio Island. What? How come? I suspect it's because different areas of Lentil have distinct types of energy flowing through them. But for now, want to see the fruits of your research in action? Watch this. Ooh, shiny. Nice. That was awesome! Ooh. Oh my gosh, so pretty! Huh. Wow, Lentil of his very own light show. What did you call it again? The Illumina Phenomenon? It's interesting, but how can it... But it it's interesting how it can occur in both Pokemon and plants. You can use these orbs to send Pokemon and Crystal Blooms in, into the Illumina state for a little while. 
When you do, watch for changes in their surroundings. We can have some of the... Can we have some of the orbs that work here on Florio? Yep. Of course you can. <laughs> We're gonna have to try these out back at the nature park. There's so many things to keep track of. Illumina orb blue. And Illumina orb yellow. Cool. Yep, yep, yep. Alright. Uh, let's go back to Floria. Try out these new Illumina orbs. Or does it only work at night? That might be so. But, nevertheless. We'll see what we can see here. Ah, uh, yeah. Careful out there. Bob. Bonk. Bonk. Shiny. I, I literally throw it like at them. Shiny. picture. Look at that. It's right at me. Stupid magic card. Well, he's sparkling. <laughs> Magic up splashing in his way, but whatever. Really? Hmm.
I always love Pokemon Snap games. Very chill. How was it? Any shots stand out? Let's see. Ooh, we got the Bufalaunch. Ooh, we got some four star Bufalaunch. Look at that. A Molga. A little three star. Warm pole. We'll give that one a try. Gorgeous. I don't have any two stars yet. I already got a three star though. Not a very good two star, but it is a two star. I want to try for a better one star though. Hello. Mm, we'll give that one a try. Bidoo. Yes. Carpy. Tiny Carpy. Ducklet. You can give it a try. And then the Swana that I failed. <laughs> All right. You move along. It's a four star photo. That flower is an excellent look. Yep. A three star Molga. Ooh, diamond three star. Nice. Good size. Woo! Diamond. Beautiful. Gorgeous. Nice really. Lower score on pose, but everything else is better. Well, mostly. <laughs> Nutello. Nice better size, yep. That's all it took. Look at that diamond. Beautiful. Bidoof. Much better. Mid creep. Not quite as good. Hmm. All right, we'll get the old one. Ducklet. Much better. Even though it's a terrible picture. Whatever. The magic card is definitely splashing in the way, but whatever. Better score. Boobity boop. Remember to check what Pokemon you're missing photos for every now and again. Let's go to the floor of your night.
I thought it was like a hair across or something. We do have finished building the dam. Wrong button. <laughs> Alright, I forgot about the score bunny. Make it so happy. Not much new with thing growth, but might as well check it. Ooh, that's cool. We don't have a one star or a three star. Let's get the three star though. Get that out of the way. Murkrow, these are all three stars. I like that one better. Eyes open. Let's get that three star in there. Swana. Wait, what? Okay. Tortera. Uh, so I still think the old one's probably better. It says I have a three star Swana in there. That's weird. Might as well get that two star Magikarp. There's a three star Magikarp. Look at that. Hoot hoot. Give it a try. Combi. Make it smiling. And sleepy snore but score bunny. Really? The old one's better. All right. I'll get the old one then. Idiot. Diamond Pidgeot. A diamond three star, not bad. A Mercrew. Three star. What do we got? Silver three star, not bad. Alright. Pincer. 
right up in your face. The Drio two star. Not bad. A three star Magikarp. Get the little hoot hoot. Better size. Yep. Combi. A bit closer. Oh yeah, look at that size. Much better. Score bunny, it's pretty much the same pose. Yeah, I think the old one's probably better. Yep. No. Oh well. What do we get? Damn, completed. Like anything I want to save? We'll save the hoodoo. Pretty good hoodoo photo. See what returning to camp shows me, if anything. Nope, okay. Nothing new. We'll go back to the park at night. That's a good, oh, more graphic picture. does or doesn't cause it to come out that pincer wrong button Mm-hmm. 
Bye, bunny. Yeah. Wrong button. Keep pressing the wrong button. There's too many buttons. Gotta keep track of them all. Sleep the magic art. Oh, what was this? It's a Sylveon. That was new. There's a pincer. Look at me. Look at me. Mm -hmm. yeah, fine. Whatever. Tombi. There's Score Bunny running around again. I keep missing this little dance there. Something is moving in the flowers. Aha, it's the Sylveon. Look at that, that was a good picture. No? Okay. I just noticed apparently we had uh, some stream issues like three minutes ago. Whoops. <laughs> well, hopefully uh, people were able to get back in. According to OBS, there are two viewers here, so... Should be fine, maybe? <laughs> Although... Yeah, I don't know. Hopefully it's still good. There's some three stars. I want to get one of the ones with actual fire in it. Not quite a few. <laughs> like score bunny in the air with some fire. Hmm. Love well, that one, I guess. Not great, but it works. There's a good Murkrow picture. That one or that one? I like that one better. Wait, there. No. Yeah. Oops. Select that one, yes. Swana. That was a square bunny picture, not a swan picture, but okay. <laughs> Magikarp. Give it a try. Sylveon. We got a few of those. Let's get the two star. Uh, well, I want it. I definitely like that picture, but we'll get the two star out of the way real quick. Pincer. A little better to facing front. Keep missing Dodrio's little dance, though. Have I not? No. Oh, I didn't actually select the Sylveon picture. Whoops. And no, we can try this one. Why not? I doubt it'll be better, but we can check. Score Bunny, three star. Flaming kick like that, you know it's Score Bunny. Yep. That is true. Not a bad picture either. Mm 
America is two star. Ooh. Not bad all around. In Bidoof. Didn't know I could swim like that. <laughs> Not bad. Yeah, not even close. <laughs> Magic carp sleeping on a rock. Nope. Okay. We'll keep the old one then. Look at that Sylvia. Fascinating behavior. A new pincer. Size is better, direction better. Yeah. Yep. Cool, cool. Dodrio headshot. Not as good. That oh, was size wasn't as good. Hmm. All right, we'll keep the old one. Few more discoveries. It may reach some new frontiers. All right. Save photos to the album. All right. So I do want to save that Murkrow photo. That's a good photo. I like it. And then the Bidoofs. Bidoofs in a row. And that is a good Sylveon picture. As it, that one. We'll save them both. go to park at night again or somewhere else oh, yeah. go jungle at night I was telling you to go jungle day a few more times with the uh, new Illumina ball If I can remember to push the right button. Feeling you know, you'll find something new. Ooh. Dang it, I missed the A bomb chance. That would have been a great time for the A bomb. Oh well. Let's see if I can get this slacking this time. I keep missing. Look at all those picky pack. Our oh, bucktail. The whooper. Whoopee. Whoopee. Oh, I, I, I couldn't get the whoopee picture because there was an Arbok in the way. And the boons be there. I didn't get a very good picture of it though. Arbok, leave the whoopee alone.
Wrong button. I'm sorry, hey bomb, I meant to throw the other thing at you. Again, mega again. Waggy! No waggy. Done. A cute little boon speed. Rolling along. The thing moves too fast. A nice light card picture. Oh, look at that pounce. I missed it. I didn't get the chance to see it. Oh well. Cannon. My part do anything? No. Okay. Hmm. What about the magic carp? Nope, I missed it. Can I get it again? Oh, there's a whoopee. I see a whoopee. Can I get a better picture of the whoopee? Whoopee! Look at that little whoopee. He's so cute. Mm-hmm. Whoop whoop. Jump for me, Magikarp. Jump. No, fine. Oh, it's a teleport. Yep. My part doesn't do anything special. How many one stars yet? Or two stars. Apparently. Let's get some of the flying ones here. Go with that one. Arbok. Nothing new. A little more up close. We can give it a try. Whoopee. Here's a good whoopee. Good fly, nah. Good sweet. Uh, what was that one? Lipard. Two star. Two cannon. That was the boon speed that I didn't quite get. Let's go. All right. Let's have a look. Pick a pick. Mm. Nice flap flap. Arbok. Nice yeah, all of better. Whoopee! A new discovery. Nice work. Not terrible. Not great either. <laughs> great 
What fascinating behavior. Not bad. Diamond two star. All right. Life cards are good. <laughs> two cannon. Not bad. Gold. I don't actually know how many Pokemon are in this game. No more type. Woo. Do I want to save any of these? Uh, whoopee. I do like to whoopee. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Let's go jungle night. All right, the moral. Mm No, I missed. <laughs> Grass in the way. Nothing new. Sleeping in a tree. Nothing new out of you.
Hey, Quaggy. Look at me. Look at me, Quaggy. No. No, not there. Wait, 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 wait. I don't know if I counted. I gotta get that picture like right at the very end. Oh, it looks like it might have counted. Yeah. I got it. We'll count it. Magic Harp, we'll give it a try. Light Hard. Sleeping in a tree. More low. It's one of the closest to center. Uh, I'll go with that one. Quaggy. Beep quag. Not as good as the last one. Alright. I guess we'll keep the last one then. Yeah, old one's better. Kirby. Still not as good. Yan Mega. Three star. Totally onto a branch while it sleeps. That was a very hard picture to get. Quaggy. I think it'll be better. Yep. Diamond Quaggy. Beautiful. You want to save any of those? I do like the morals on a line though. Even if Professor Dum Dum doesn't like them. And my diamond Quaggy. Okay. Yeah, we'll go there again. Another jungle night.
Uh, Toucan in there? Where? Uh, is he Toucan in? Oh, I'll see you Toucan in. Might have been a blink and you miss it type of thing. Sleeping two cannon. See what we come up with. We'll give that a try. There you does. Might as well. More little as always, I got a million of them. Two cannon, Yon Mega, Carpy. Let's go. Alright. Nice huh? A little bit better. I'll take it. Are you just mm, a little bit better? All right, we'll take it. More lull. That's a lot better, actually. Yeah. Two cannon. 
Only kept the one pose and the one star. <laughs> and not even as good. Okay. Neon Mega. Much better. Much better. Look at that. From bronze to diamond. <laughs> Garby. Nice He's sparkly. He's a sparkle carp. And a little bit better. Cool. Anything I want to save here? Most of it just more a little. <laughs> I don't want to save that though. Good picture. Alright. I believe I would like to go to... Go back to the park at night. I haven't been to the park during the day in a while. Let's try that first. Be careful. Fast asleep. We do swimming in the river. All right, we mulga. I got the zappy on time. Oh well. Yeah, well, not enough. You need to get that jumping magic up though.
Lots of Grookey and Peachy pictures there. <laughs> and throw an apple on a bowl. You know, like you do. <laughs> Vivillion. That is not a Vivillion. That's uh, definitely a Buffalant. Uh, you want to you wanna, you wanna try that again? That is a Buffalant. Fine. Be that way. Need to go to Molga. Is that kind of a new one? Alright, fine. We'll try it anyways. Wanna! Like that one. Taylo. Nice little two star Taylo. Pichu. Uh, whoa, let's get that four star. Flowers blocking it a little bit, but yeah. Little two star action. A little more one star. Alright, let's, let's get the four stars then. Whichever it happens to be. Uh, meh. None of them are all that great. There's flowers blocking the way, but whatever. Bidoof. Yep, that's a bidoof. Ducklet. Sure. <laughs> Grookey. A lot of one star Grookies. I didn't, I didn't get any Grookey in that last little bit there, apparently. Largest, not good enough. Crystal Bloom, apparently doesn't let me show it, but whatever. Okay, let's go. Emolga, two star. Having a nice meal. Could have gotten a three or four star if I had caught it actually uh, zapping. Probably a four star actually. Wimble. Not that great. Yeah. I'll give the old one. It looks better anyways. Wanna? Mm, nope. Halo, two star. Looks like it's been bopped by something. That's because it has. I threw an apple at it. A four star Pichu. Fascinating behavior. I'm surprised you can even tell. Yeah. There were flowers in the way. What, what am I supposed to say? Size is good. They're both diamond, that's funny. I'll give the old one. It looks cooler anyways. It looks happy, doesn't it? I I guess. I I guess I can't tell. If you say it looks happy, then sure, it looks happy. I, 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 Alright. Make a few more discoveries. You may reach some new frontiers. Okay. Anything there that I want to save? Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> Wasn't really a whole lot there worth uh, saving. Yeah. Although, that's a pretty cute picture. Happy vibes. More happy vibes. Look at all the happy vibes. Hmm. Alright. Let's go to park at night.
Why can't I do it? down there. Hey, Pichu. I, I can't see the Pichu. What a boobla. Pichu! Pichu! I need to make sure I get the Dodrio -Dod dance. Sparkly Markro. A little bit. Yeah, the Dodrio dance. Nah. You're pointing in too many directions. Encountered it as Sylveon or for Terror, the one that where it jumped out, but we'll check we'll check it in and find out. Hey. Move a lot. Dang growth. Murk growth. 
We already got a three star, but we can check that two star. Or that one star rather. And sir. Barely got that two star. Not gonna be very many points. Dodrio, got that dance. Carpy. Give it a try. Sylveon. Got a bunch of one stars. That's probably the best one though. No subject. Yeah, it doesn't count any of those. Darn. Much better. Much better. Yeah. Red up close. Not quite as good though. Murkrow. Mm, a little bit better. Alright. We'll take it. <laughs> Barely got it. Having a nice meal. Yes, of course. That totally you you can definitely tell that's what's happening there. Is this is Torterra. Hard to tell exactly what it's doing. But we got it. Sort of. <laughs> the Rio little nice little dance. Nice. Beautiful. Kirby. Nope. Old one is better. Sylveon, one star. Not bad. Make a few more discoveries. Okay. I'm trying. I'm, re I'm really trying. Anything I want to save there? Mm, not particularly. I do like the... Uh, I count it as a Torterra picture, but that's definitely a Sylveon picture. I'm saving it. Yeah. Mm. We'll go back to camp. And I don't know what I want to do next. Hmm. We'll do park a day. Why not? I'm trying to make some new discoveries, that's all. Bucking Buffalant. Ah, oh, I missed it. Did a little flip. Do it again. No? Fine. You really gotta be watching everywhere.
Hey, get the Amulga to come over. Oh well. NBD. That actually turned out not bad. Nice flying swana. It says it's Tangrowth like love them. That's about all it says. Oh well, hello there. Yeah, the cute little picture. Trying to get all the good pictures of the Grookey and Pichu. Good to see you. Oh, we got some Pichus. What do we got? We got a two-star Pichu. We already got four star P2 covered. Yeah, let's get the two star then. Uh, pick your favorite. I don't really like any of these, but I uh, guess we'll go with that. Grookey. Got a three star Grookeys. We need four stars. Nope, not good. Let's get a three star then. That's pretty cool. Buffalant, uh, Bucking. Give that one a try. Wormple, doesn't look like anything new there. Swana. Really, Swana in flight doesn't count for anything new. Well, we'll give it a try anyways. Dodrio. Talo. Beauty. Yeah, I like that picture. And Florges. I think that was an accidental while I was getting the 
Me too, Murky. Let's see what we've got. Hey, it's Pichu. Mm, not terrible. Murky. Woohoo! Beautiful diamond three star groupie. Be blind. Another diamond three star bouffalant, and bouffalant is complete. Cool. Yay, bouffalant! Vivillion. Mm, nope, not quite. The old one's better. Marble, I doubt it will surpass. Yeah, no, not even close. Swana, though, has potential. Maybe? Nope, not quite. Dodrio? Seems like something caught its attention. Better all around. Yep. Look at that. Beautiful. Hello. I don't expect it to do very well. Yeah, no. Old one is better. Bidoo. Better all around. Look at that. Beautiful. And it's a cuter photo. Look at them, they're adorable. Ooh, level three. Fantastic. Amazing, your research on this course is going great. Make sure you're being thorough with other areas too. Yep, yep. I'm gonna head back through the jungle in just a second. Woo. Let's save some photos though. Let's see. I do like that swan in the picture. Good swan in the picture. Yeah, that be doof picture. And the Groogie and Pichu just, they're too dang fast. Yeah, hurry, hurry, exactly. <laughs> uh. Okay. Returning to camp. Anything new? Nope, okay. Let's go back to the jungle for a little bit. Whoa, jungle day. I haven't done that in a while. I don't think. I don't know. It's hard to keep track. Mm -mm. Pretty sure I got a decent photo there at least. Missed. Hey, Arbok, leave the whoopee alone. Leave the poor whoopee alone. 
Whoopee. <laughs> yeah, it's beautiful in the way. Look at all those day bombs. Part. Well, it's centered, but I got it preening. I've been a little too close. <laughs> I picture. Nothing there. See what we got here. Nothing new for you, Palma. Darn. I thought I did pretty well with some of those A-Palm shots. Better one there at least, probably. Beautiful. That's a good picture of Beautiful. Boom, sweet. Might give that a try. Picky pick. I don't have any one stars yet. It's slightly off center though. 
don't have any two stars or three stars for Wooper. Let's get that three star though. Arbok, anything new? No, we'll give that a try though. Lipard. Two cannon. Magikarp. Magzire. He's so happy. Let's have a look. Better pose. Size isn't quite as good. But it is better. Alright, we'll go with it. Much better all around. Diamond one star. Beautiful. Oh, beautiful eye, I should say. <laughs> A little bit better. Oh no, it's not. Not quite as good. Oh, the direction and size weren't. Or in pose. The only thing that was better was placement. Alright, we'll keep the last one then. Picky pick. One star. Mm. Not bad. Could be better. Whoopee. Woo, diamond three star. Go whoopee. Nice work. Yeah, a little too close. Look okay, at the old one. Nice work. Light part. Uh -huh. Yeah, I didn't expect that to be as good. Nice mm, maybe. Nope. Oh, this side was way off. Never mind. <laughs> Sharpie. Mm, nope. Nope. Alrighty. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We'll learn all kinds of new things. Yes, of course. Anything I want to save here? I do like my whoopee. Look at him. He's adorable. Yeah, angry whoopee. That beautifly is good though. Alrighty. I think that's it. Yeah. Let's go jungle night again. I just noticed that's an Arbok. I didn't even notice that before. It might not have been there before either. Sleepy Arbok. And of course, the moral always around.
No. What's that? Hey, good eye. Now we can get a closer look at those wolf Pokemon. Ah. Cool. Hey, come here. Don't turn away from me. I dare you. Flying overhead. I thought I saw something. A shadow or something rather. The shot and all four of them in a row. There we go. Mm. Sort of. There we go. That's better. The scan that would make them jump. Quig. Yeah, Meg was doing, but it was doing something. It had like a tail curled up. Interesting. Marillal. 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 I did enjoy myself. Thanks for asking. Lipard. Nothing new there. Arbok. Sleepy Arbok. Ariados. Got a nice two star there. Carpy. Does that not count as something new? I guess not. Three star. I don't know what the four star is for Magikarp then. That was a good picture though. Marlow. Yeah, That's a good picture too. Quag. Quag. Those are attempts at the Magikarp. <laughs> Let's do this. 
Lipard? Mm, maybe. Nope, not quite. It's hard to surpass that. Sleepy Arbok. Nope. Old one is better. Okay. Harpy. Good pose. Size is a lot lower though. Yeah. Molin. Beautiful. Slightly better. <laughs> More or less the same picture. Sleepy Quag. Looks like the old one was better though. Yeah. Where we get path of the swamp. Yay. Anything worth saving here? Mm. Yeah, I don't think so. Yeah, we'll go jungle night again. One last time will probably uh, take us to the end of the stream here. Where are you those up there? No. What about the Illumina Ball? No. Still doesn't count. Definitely an Aridos. Die. That was definitely a bird of some sort.
Know that I got anything new here? Great job. Yeah, man, the hose like literally last second. Catch it. All right, what do we got? Oh, we got something new for our Yardos. Hanging in a tree. Yep, it did count. Cool. That's better picture. Lipard. Give that a try. Let again. Nothing new here. Doesn't look like it. All right. And then the no subject stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Better? Not quite. Lipard. Hmm? Nope. Three star Ariados. Not terrible. Can definitely be better though. Level two. Level two. Yay. All right. Got a friend. Camera fan. Snap a total of 500 pictures. By the way. Yay, some of your report. Cool. I think we'll grab that report and then we'll uh, probably end it there. I don't think I have anything worth uh, saving here. Save the Ariados. Okay. Return to camp. What do we got? What new professor? Yay! Now then. We've got a new island to explore now. I've pinpointed two teleportation points we can use. Huh? Oh, where? Look. One on this long, narrow island and another offshore in the middle of the water. Captain Vince never got to that spot offshore, did he? This is going to be amazing! I'll let you decide what order you want to visit them in. Keep up the good work. Alrighty. Well, I think... Oh. How's it going? Enjoying your research, Johns? Listen, I've got something to tell you. There's a feature I originally forgot to suggest to the professor. But I got him to add it to your research camera. What, what kind of feature? 
It's a melody player. It lets your camera play a little tune. A little music and prompt Pokemon to show you whole new sides of themselves. Wow. Sounds awesome! Rita. Rita, could you fill in the details? Yeah. Sure thing! If you press R, a melody will play. While it's playing, you can press R to, again to make it stop. Wow. A little music could wake up sleeping Pokemon. Or make some Pokemon get up and dance. I haven't had the chance to try it though, so I'm no expert yet. Uh -huh. So next, let's give it a whirl! Cool. Well, I do believe we will try out that new uh, song feature as well as Thanks. check out the sweltering sands. Alrighty, we will do that next time. And speaking of next time, if you want to catch me live again, I stream every day of the week except the weekends now. Monday through Friday. Uh, Monday, Wednesday will be more of this Pokemon Snap. Starting uh, usually at, at 7. I started a little bit late today because I had some things I needed to take care of. But usually starting at 7. Uh, Tuesdays and Thursdays will be Minecraft, also starting around 7. Uh, and this is Mountain Time, by the way. Uh, if that's not your time zone, you can check the widget down below. It'll tell you what it is in your time zone. And then Friday, I will be streaming at 2 p.m. Mountain Time. And that will be Pokemon Fire Red, working on a 100% completion run there. Uh, if you want to catch up on any past videos, obviously this is the first one of this series, so there won't be any past VODs, but if you were uh, wanting to catch up on anything of the other series that you may have missed, you can check out my YouTube. There's a link to that down below where I got playlists for everything. Um, while you're in the description, you can also check out my Discord and Patreon. There, Those are linked down there as well. And until next time, I will see you guys around. Thanks as always for watching. If you enjoyed this video, consider subscribing by clicking the icon in the top right, and don't forget to ring that bell so you can be notified of any future VOD uploads. If you'd like to see more of this series, click the playlist in the top left. If you'd like to check out one of my other series, click the playlist in the bottom left. If you want to catch me live, check out my Twitch, link down below. Once again, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.